This video was produced by Lion Total Care, dedicated to keeping you safer longer. Advanced Cleaning and Advanced Inspection of Particulate Blocking Hoods An advanced inspection requires a clean hood, so that's our first step. Hood should be cleaned every 6 months and inspected every 12 months. If your hood is exposed to products of combustion, contamination, smoke, blood, body fluids, or hazardous substances, it must be cleaned soon as possible after exposure. Avoid the spread of chemical contamination or hazardous combustion products to other laundry. Always wash your hood separately from other items. Never wash your hood at home or in public laundry facilities. Never use high-velocity power washers or pressure hoses for washing hoods. The water pressure generated by these tools can severely damage protective materials and seams. Any cleaning solution used should have a pH between 6.0 and 10.5. Station Care from Lion Total Care is designed for the cleaning of NFPA 1971 hoods. Always check MSDS and products instructions before use. Wash temperature should not exceed 105 degrees Fahrenheit, 40 degrees Celsius. Use low extractor speeds less than 100 Gs. Double rinse. Double rinsing removes residual dirt and ensures detergent removal. If your machine will not automatically double rinse, a complete second rinse cycle should be run without adding detergent. Load machine with hoods to be washed. Follow machine manufacturer's instructions for proper load size. Overloading the machine can lead to incomplete cleaning and other poor cleaning results. Add cleaning product per manufacturer's instructions. Set washing machine on normal cycle and start the wash cycle. Remove the hood from the washing machine. If the hood is not already inside out from washing, turn it inside out to expose the inner surfaces. Dry by hanging in a shaded area that receives good cross ventilation or use a fan to circulate the air. Do not use automatic dryers. The mechanical action and excessive heat may damage or shrink your hood. Do not hang the hood to dry in direct or indirect sunlight or in fluorescent light. Light will severely reduce the strength of the seams and will discolor and greatly reduce the strength and protective qualities of the components of the hood. Never dry clean your hood. Dry cleaning will damage the hood and reduce its protective qualities. Advanced Inspection of Particulate Blocking Hoods Specifically, we will demonstrate a light evaluation of hood particulate blocking layers. A smoke evaluation can also be performed as well. For more information on smoke evaluation testing, reference section 12.2 of the 2020 edition of the NFPA 1851 standard. At a minimum, the following four areas of the hood should be evaluated. 1. The left side of the hood with the edge of the test area within 2.5 inches of the hood opening. 2. The right side of the hood with the edge of the test area within 2.5 inches of the hood opening. 3. The back of the hood. 4. The middle of any seam area joining two pieces of the particulate blocking layer. The evaluation apparatus consists of a clear head form combined with a light source bright enough to show the changes in the density of the liner materials. The light source should be mounted and centered in the inside of the head form. The light source needs to have a switch for turning the light on and off. The evaluation should be conducted indoors in an area that can be darkened. This provides optimum viewing of potential damage to the particulate blocking layer of the hood interface component. To perform the evaluation, don the hood on the head form. Turn on the light inside the head form. Evaluate areas of the hood that have a particulate blocking layer in place, including the seams. If the light is brighter in some areas than in others, this is a sign of a possible defect or damage that compromises the hood's performance. For comparison purposes, use a new, unused hood to establish the normal appearance of light on an undamaged hood. If damage or defects are detected, note it on the inspection form and take the hood out of service. For additional information, contact Lion Total Care.